Coach Smith here with Ball Talk, looking at the blocker mover offense, usually associated with the University of Virginia. Here's the part one, the initial movements. We start in a four high alignment, kick it to the right, four drops down, three drops down. And then it's going to go into more of a wheel route. All right, everybody moves the same. One, two, and three are the movers. Four and five are the blockers. As the ball moves, as the person with the ball moves, the other two guards move. Four setting a pin down, five setting a flare screen. The defender that goes under the screen, if they go under, then it's that flare screen. If not, the three would cut back door. You can see here's your two blockers. You set your pin down and here's your flare. And then since nothing was there, he comes, brings it back out, starts moving, same pin down, and he turns this into just a kind of a curl and then that pick and roll. Part two is what happens if you need to reverse the movement. So let's say that the ball came up, you can't kick it to the two. Well then the five and four just go opposite side, kick it to the three, and now the three moves the opposite way and the circle or the wheel route swings the opposite way. All right, here they're gonna set it up, but this time they're gonna run it the other way. So they're running it the other way with now the top guys, their flare screen, the other ones are pinned down, and then they just reversed it. Another pick and roll. Part three is the flare screen shot. If it's not open, then they just go right into a pick and roll. So as the ball goes, they travel, flare screen, shots not open, pick and roll up there. Those are three parts that'll help you go ahead and teach and get into the blocker mover system. All right, in this clip, I want you to see that they're going to pretty much go through this rotation twice. That pin down, and then they start that wheel action. Bring them back up. Again, they're moving in space. Another option, instead of that pick and roll from that wing, you can have a pick and pop. Curls, instead of rolling, it kicks out for the shot. If you're a coach looking to put in the block or move or at least start the action, Again, this game is a great game to go watch. Now, I'm a Virginia Tech fan, so I hated that they lost this game. But it's a great way to get a good idea. It's a great camera angle um, on how the block remover works. And you can start to add in just a simple set of those actions. Thanks for watching. And again, this is not the full block remover offense. These are just the first few actions that you can run once you start implementing it into your system with your players.